Hi guys, welcome to the best past and present team in FC24 version Manchester United. The reason I've chose Manchester United is, more likely, they're getting no team of the years. So let's kick start it this week, guys, and bring back a series which you guys enjoy, I enjoy, and we get to see a lot of players which I've never used in the game. A few of them I have, a few of them I haven't, and a lot of players which you guys might be interested in. If you guys are new, make sure you leave a like rating, hit the bell button as well, so you never miss an upload, and leave a comment, guys. We do heart every comment, read every comment, and even apply to some as well. And if you want to see any more of these done, Feel free to let us know. The comment section is yours. Use it. Uh, show some love. And uh, let's uh, get on with the video, guys. The past and present Manchester United team. The only stipulation is, guys, highest rated players. That's how we build the team. So this team is pretty unique, um, but it should be fun to play with. Now, starting off with the bench and reserves, guys. I've just plonked these in there, but you can see a lot of players not making it in. We've got Edwin van der Sar. He's not in there. Uh, we have got Casemiro. Could have used his, obviously, uh, higher rated version but it's not in style them so don't matter we've got Forlan, Memphis Depay, Lukaka, uh, Blanc, Rooney, Keane the uh, fantastic winter wild cards which plays centre mid as well, Damian, Nemanja Matic, Hoyland throwing him in there and Verón and you guys might think the real United fans will know but the ones which aren't real United fans might think why have I plonked in a random bold guy in the manager position if you guys didn't know, this is Henning Berg, the first person to ever win a Premier League title with two different clubs. The first club was Blackburn, the second club was Manchester United. He's won a Champions League trophy, he's won four Premier League trophies, an FA Cup and a League Cup as well. Henning Berg, there you go guys, thought I'd throw him in there as a manager. Shout out to Marshall for letting me know about that one. And now we move on to the main team. Now, with the way the team set out, guys, it isn't a free at the back. We are playing foot champions, more likely going to lose. That's the way the cookie crumbles. Now, in net, guys, because we're not using Van der Sar or Schmeichel, the next, well, the highest rated Manchester United past and present keeper in the game, guys, is Rude Van Nistelrooy. It's a shame they didn't Photoshop some gloves onto his dynamic image, but there he is in the centre-back position. Uh, centre-back in the, in the goalkeeper. We actually have no goalkeepers in this team. There you are. A team with no goalkeepers, this should be fun. In the left centre-back position, guys, we are going to drop all the way down to 88. And we're going to go with Varam on the left. In the middle is going to be uh, Ferdinand. And the next one should be an SBC player, which a lot of people had at the start of the game, but I've not seen him since. And it's Nemanja Vidic. So there's my uh, three centre-backs, Varane, Ferdinand and Vidic. To be fair, probably would have put them in there anyway. Maybe throwing a player in month, Harry Maguire. But the way we do it, guys, highest rated players. That's how the team's built. There's no emotion with this. There's no personal pickings. This is just the way it works. And with that, it does, unfortunately, throw some sketchy players into the team. But players which you guys might not have thought of and... Uh, yeah, you may not have thought of, but we are going to use them anyway. And the first player is Liverpool fans don't want him. Uh, I don't think Newcastle fans want him. So Manchester United fans, we've dumped Michael Owen in you guys. He's your highest rated left midfielder in the game. One of your own, right? You won a Premier League trophy with it. He's yours. You can have him, guys. Um, so Michael Owen's in the left mid. Now, thankfully, on the right mid, we are back to prime at Manchester United. And we have got George Best who is an absolute beast um, and a player which I've actually not used since packing him. So we get to have a play around with him today. I have played against him a few times in champs. He is a demon to play against. And also, if you guys do want to come back to this video um, after we redo it, maybe towards footies or in between the team of season or whatever, you guys can come and see how different this team is to the one we build now. And I'm looking forward to building more guys. Let me know some teams down below who we could build in the future. In the centre mid position, we have got a person who likes to suck his daughter's... Um, where is he at, guys? Where is he at? He is an 89 Thunderstruck. There he is, Paul Skulls, guys. Paul Skulls thrown in there. Recently, been in the headlines for commenting on uh, Jesse Lingard's Instagram posts, but that's only a bit of banter, a bit of fun as well. And then, joining him in the midfield, guys, is another fantastic centre midfielder who actually does play for United currently, and it is Bruno Fernandes, a captain of Manchester United as well. So he's jumping on into that centre midfield position. That completes our midfield and defence. To be fair, looks prime Manchester United, right? Maybe not um, Michael Owen, but maybe not Van Nistelrooy in goalkeeper, but up front he would have been there. Looks not bad as a Man United team, does it? Not bad. Now, we're moving into the attackers, which are... 
full of glorious players. First one. Left hand side, right hand side, sorry. It is going to be a player which was released yesterday. Um, as I bought him, guys. I've done two videos of him now. We're not going to check it out. We did another team with Marcus Rashford yesterday. He's in the team today. Travella Plus on the right-hand side. And uh, we scored a hat-trick of them in, the, in that video. And then on the left-hand side, Manchester United through and through. It is Bobby Charlton, guys. The highest-rated player in the team at 92. And uh, fully deserved position. He's also got very weird alternate positions, guys. Centre forward in Cam. Like, you would have thought maybe he had centre mid, maybe he had a striker, but he's been given centre forward in Cam. But there he is. In there. Jobs are good. Em. And also, this takes me to my next question, guys. If EA were ever to add in something to do with managers, right? I, I, I think EA missing a trick by not having legend managers in the game. Um, whether it be icon managers like Sir Alex Ferguson, um, maybe even hero managers i don't know if that'd be a thing as well um who would you want to bring in for united i think alex ferguson's number one but maybe there's another manager you want to bring back into the game um to finish oh louis van hal yeah van hal's a good shout final player in the team guys um a player which manchester united in recent years he's been the top of the list guys right it's it's cristiano ronaldo he goes in there matt busby uh clough as well um but there he is guys Ronaldo in the team Winter Wildcard. This is a full chem team as well, which is absolutely brilliant. And uh, we get to have a play around with the Winter Wildcard. Cristiano Ronaldo, who is now out in the Saudi League. There it is. The best past and present team of Manchester United on FC24. We're going to play some games. We're going to have some fun. And if you guys did watch the uh, I Upgrade Your Team on FC24, we did change his team from Manchester United to Liverpool. Well, today we're going to be rocking with a Manchester United kit to make it look a little bit more authentic. Not a thing I want to do, but we're probably going to lose loads of games because of it. Let's go and play them and see how we do. Right, guys, game number one versus Act Back. I don't know what that is. Larice apparently got no hands. Ooh, it's a five, three at the back versus... Ooh, that's a bloody good team. Holy crap. Guys, first on a Pelly as well. Right. My man's been blessed. Okay, let's go. Oh. Oh, he let me have the position, guys. Marcus Rashford, 1-0. Brilliant. Oh, good goal, good goal. Oh, he's so good. This play guys, we keep getting good players at the moment. Dink. Back post, Varane. Oh, it's a goal. It's a goal. We're catching him with some, like, glitchy goals, guys, with the corner. And then the uh, Traveller, but I'll take it, guys. 2-1. Good goal. 2-2. Two, two. Oh, he's made the... Penalty! Are you drunk? Are you absolutely drunk, mate? <laughs> no! Get in there! Oh, it couldn't have happened to a nicer person, mate. Couldn't have happened to a nicer person. Pwah. Guys, if you've seen the full, if you're on Twitch, you would have seen the full game. This man deserved to get that. He deserved it. Right, one game, one win. Never give up. Right, guys, game number two. Polska. Larissa again, guys. Nice setup. Red Pedro as well. Fantastic. Guys, we've hit another fucking nerd. Oh. Save, save on this little boy. How'd you fluke that one? <laughs> fair play, fair play, fair play. No, he's, he's got that as well. This man in his set pieces. What am I meant to do? Oh, wow. This isn't not this isn't normal guys. This is not this is not normal what I'm playing in qualifiers. I'm not even kidding you. Who does that in qualifiers? Oh my dears, the aerial of that guy's Ronaldo. And we've got him at squad, guys. Sui Oh no, wait what? Oh, interesting. That's a guy's the aerial on that was crazy. Nice, nice. Nice, George Best. Oh, it's 3-2, guys. We're back in the game. George Best showing up. Love to see it. 
It's about damn time. Oh, I still got it. <laughs> GG's, man. GG's. Bang. Come on. Right, 4-3, guys. At least we're scoring goals. Bobby Charlton with a finish near post. Bang. And there's game over, guys. With the incoming. Maybe not. Bang. Right, 5-4. To be fair, guys, we haven't been that bad. With, with the team we played against, the player we played against, who's very, very good, I think we've done all right. You know? I think we've done all right. But Marcus Rashford, some of them chances you missed. My days. Right, guys, our third and final game, and hopefully he's not Hopefully he's not a try-hard like the other two. He's a bit more fun. Right, Casillas, Maldi, no, he's try-harding. Hey, fair play, guys. What a team. Right, United, let's do this. Oh, wow. Fair play, mate. He's stuttered. Right, 1-0 down. Yay. I, I absolutely hate Saturdays. I absolutely hate Saturdays. Too much room here. Could put one back here. Sui! Right, Ronaldo makes it 2 1, guys. We are struggling. Oh, Bobby Charlton. Oh, it's 2 2. Oh, we're back in the game, guys. We're tramping. But it's working. Nice. Sui. Oh, boom. And there's number three, guys. What a comeback. We are not giving up. Finally, Sui! Right, Ronaldo with two goals. Might be. Yeah. Oh, that is terrible. Great attack, guys. 3 3. Caroline Hansen. Boosh. Oh, Ronaldo. Delicate dink under the keeper, guys. 4 3. Hat trick, I think. Is that a hat trick for Ronaldo? Gorgeous. Oh, oh, that is unreal. That is an unreal goal, guys. Keeping the ball in the air. We've got to do the Rashford. Oh, we're not doing the Rashford celebration. That was a sick finish. Bump. And then somehow Rashford in front of the defender. Love it. Hansen, where the fuck are you from? Well, that was too... I don't know how he's got the concentration to do that, guys. 5-4, what a finish. Bang, bang, goal, come on. Rashford to Charlton, 6-4, guys. This is tough. Hmm. He's pressed start, guys. He's quitting in the 86. Or is he making... He's gone. Guys, he's just gone. He's quit. He's done. Right, guys. Two wins out of three. Some good players in this team, but maybe not who you expected. And there it is. Done, guys. The team of Manchester United. The best past and present available at the moment. Obviously, standout players, guys. I'm going to go up. Honestly, you wouldn't expect it. The defense is fantastic. Even if you conceded a lot of goals, the formation didn't help, but the, the defense is fantastic. Paul Skulls, though, is going to get a, a proper mention. He is a little bit of a beast. Really enjoyed him. I don't think I was playing Bobby Charlton in the correct position, um, but he's clinical in the right, right place. Same for Ronaldo. Him, on the other hand, guys, that freestyle weak foot was costing me a lot of chances. Um, but you can see the, the things that we have done with him. Michael Owen was all right. George Best was really good. Not playing in the right position, no. But there it is, Manchester United team. Guys, leave a like rating. Hit the bell button. All that good stuff. And have a fantastic rest of your day. And let us know in the comment section below who you want to see in the future.